human robot interaction research has been carried out in uh, developed countries in urban settings and uh, i feel that uh, there is a you know there is a lot of scope and there is a lot of research which um, which hasn't been done you know hardly any research has been done in um, you know rural settings so this was a, a, a feasibility study uh, to see how people perceive a robot helping them in a daily activity this newly adopted village by mata ambatananda mayamath in tamil nadu at ayan pradi was a perfect setting for the study this remote village in rural area has not much exposure to technology bringing technology to difficult so social situations can be challenging there is a relationship of trust which makes a study like this work better so usually this uh, women uh, they carry they spend at least uh, one hour of their time daily and also they walk at least 600 meters a day uh, for every trip to their homes carrying water we wanted to see how a technology of this nature would impact their lives positively and in some cases affect the social fabric of the way they are, they do things in the village suraj <laughs> உங்கள் வீட்டுக்கு செல்ல வழி காட்டுவீர்களா நாம் தண்ணீரை அங்கு எடுத்து செல்லலாம் இந்த கேங்களில் இருக்கும் தண்ணீரை உங்கள் வீட்டிற்கு எடுத்து சென்று தயவு செய்து காலி கேங்களை திருப்பி எடுத்து வந்து என் மேல் வையுங்கள் இன்று நான் உதவி செய்தேன் என்று நம்புகிறேன் எல்லா தடவையும் சாப்பிடுவதற்கு முன்பு கை கழுவ நினைவு கொள்ளுங்கள் நன்றி one thing that i really found very interesting was the uh, although people the village people in the village realized that the robot was being tele operated we somewhere formed a bond with the robot and uh, we could find the elderly women especially in the village thanking the robot for having brought the water to their homes
one interesting thing uh, observation and um, um, result of the study was uh, when we asked the participants uh, what they thought uh, was the gender of the robot almost 40% of the participants who themselves were women said that the gender of the robot is uh, a female uh, this was an interesting finding because uh, this also shows the cultural influence in spite of the robot um, you know speaking uh, with them in tamil and giving them instructions in tamil uh, in a male's voice the women uh, perceived the robot as a as a female and explained to us that this is a task uh, done by female so it was a very interesting cultural uh, influence they showed in this um, during this study basically running more studies like this will give us uh, more perspective on their requirements so some of the villagers came up with suggestions can this robot help us to carry firewood for example or carry sacks for us so it was very interesting to get their perspective and understand their requirements uh, so in the future we would like to explore more on you know what are their needs and if the robot can be designed to you know address some of the needs uh, of the villagers